something comforting about the typing. I don't know what it is, but uh, it does it for me. There is rarely a day that Pat Costigan doesn't get the chance to sit down and tap out a few lines on some old typewriter. Even in this day of computer keyboards, customers keep calling. All the time. <laughs> I get it. Almost every day we get a call from somebody or an email from someone just saying, do you repair typewriters still? And uh, yeah, we do. Pat's days of fixing typewriters actually dates back decades to 1976 and the family business. That's when he joined his father's typewriter sales and service shop, which back then bustled. We had the state contract for cleaning manual typewriters, so every day you were doing that. Today, it's part profession, part hobby. Repairing typewriters, right he says, here. makes up about 20% um, of his business machine repair company, Costco Technologies. But it's not just the tinkering with these old relics he enjoys, but so many have a story. Who owned it, where it was found, and he loves hearing them all. I enjoy them. I enjoy the people. I enjoy their stories. They always love to just take a few minutes to talk. People treasure them. They, I, the letters I've gotten from, I'll get thank you notes from people, and they always type them. There's just something he says about an antique typewriter. It's like an old friend. Nostalgia brings back memories. And that's why, as long as somebody keeps making parts for these old typewriters, he'll keep fixing them, making sure the ribbon's tight, the keys don't stick. Remember? It's uh, something very familiar to me and to others. Uh, that's part of the typing experience and the bell. Always important. I always make sure the bell is working.